The abs stop me dead in my tracks. Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. My name is Pineapple and today I am doing another episode of my Wishing Well Legacy Challenge. So this is a legacy challenge with a twist. The twist being that my Sims Lena has to wish for certain things from the Wishing Well on certain days. So on Saturday she wishes for simoleons, Sunday she wishes for skills, Monday she wishes for happiness, Tuesday she wishes for simoleons again, and then Wednesday is Wild Card Wednesday, Thursday nothing, and Friday is Freaky Friday. So on Wild Card Wednesday and Freaky Friday, I roll the die to determine whether she wishes for romance, a child, grades, promotion, youth, or a life. Ooh, so if you're confused by any of that, it is in the description box down below. I also just realized that, like, there's no, like, um, upstairs <laughs> in the frame. Um, but this is Selena and she is mourning Connie and Margot because she, she's she been kind of having a hard time, I think. Um, you know, she did lose both of her parents um, in the same day and she just like blackmailed somebody and she just got aged up spontaneously and her hair went gray. Um, and so I was thinking she's kind of having a little bit of a midlife crisis. So what do people do when they have a midlife crisis? Well, they buy cars. Um, we can't do that in The Sims. I mean, I could get like, like a fake kind of car, but we'll not do that. What I want her to do is I want her to, um, change her appearance. And I think we're going to give her a tattoo. Um, so I'm excited about that. Once she walks out of here, I'm going to relock the store for her because them mourning on their own time is unacceptable. <laughs> um, but lock door for everyone, everybody. Um, but yeah, it is a Saturday. So this morning, um, in the last episode, Selena was able to blackmail somebody for money, which she did. Um, <laughs> and I think we got about a thousand simoleons. Um, but yeah, I am also just want to quickly apologize for any of the episodes going, whoa, you have abs. Jesus, Mario. Oh my God. Look at those things. That is like, what? What? What level of fitness is that? Can I see? No, I guess I can't. But oh my God, woman, you were ripped. <laughs> but like the abs stopped me dead in my tracks. Um, but yeah, the last week was Thanksgiving week and I got the schedule mixed up a little bit. But anyways, I hope that wasn't too big of a deal. But I got these awesome tattoos. I'm not quite sure. Well, we're not going to give her this one. <laughs> That's a little bit too intense. Um, but I was thinking we could give her um, something kind of cool. I'm not quite sure what. Um, some of these are really, really edgy. Um, so, wow. Oh, my gosh. It's like these things are like really intense. Um, these ones are a bit like less intense. I think I might go. I really like. Yeah, I really like. Wait, where can I find it? I really like this one. It's kind of hard to see with her hair. Um, but let's see, maybe if we put her into swimsuit. Well, let's just take off her hair. Um, but yeah, oh, and the swimsuit too. Oh my gosh, girl, you are you are annoying sometimes. Um, here, we'll take off the hair here, and then you can see it. Um, but yeah, it just kind of fades up, and so maybe it means something deep and meaningful to her. But now she has a tattoo. Um, and Marcus has had tattoos from the beginning, but his, he's had them since he was younger, you know, since he was a young adult, and so they just weren't really Selena's shtick, um, but, you know, she's kind of wanting to step out of the box because she's old. She's getting up there. Um, but yeah, so the girls are home. Selena, we can't see your tattoo now, but, you know. Um, I'm going to have her not cry. Um, I'm actually, I wonder if she can do like a sad workout. Can she work out when she's sad? Yeah. Um, we'll just have her work out for the moment while we focus on the girls. Um, they're so exciting. And I honestly am unsure which one of them is going to be heir apparent. Um, <laughs> I have no idea. Um, where is... Mabel, what are you up to? Oh, she's gonna play and stuff. So cute. So cute. Um, but, um, I thought I heard the train coming, but I 
don't know if I did, but we might have to, as always, pause when the train comes because it's so gosh, oh, yep, yeah, the train is coming. Gosh darn it, I thought I could avoid it, but it snuck up on me like it sounded and then it was really quiet for a long time. I was like, okay, it passed. Nope, it's not. So now I gotta wait. Ugh. Okay, now I think we're good. Oh my gosh. Um, but Selena is having a phone call um, from Corbin asking if it'd be okay to come over to hang out. Um, I don't see why not. Um, he might as well just come on over. Um, I don't know if he's met the twins. I don't think he's met them since their babies. Like, do they know him? Um... Yep, they know him. Um, just since they're babies. Are you watching the TV from out here? Like, what? Is there a rule that you're not allowed to play in the living room? So you're, like, sitting outside this really weird girl. She's a weird one. You know? Like, this little this little kid is, like, kind of, like, edgy. But she's, like, a cool edgy. I don't know. <laughs> um, but, yeah, Selena is just exercising for her job. Um... And also, I, I would like to... She's only at level 7 fitness. Um, oh, this is broken. Let me just replace that. Um, but she's only at level 7, and, like, Marcus is at... Um, can I not... Yeah, Marcus is at level... Um, oh, my gosh. I cannot with this. Um, he's already at level 8 for painting. And he's not even, like, our main focus, but he's just always painting. So I kind of wanted to focus on Selena kind of leveling up her skills. Um, hopefully that'll go quickly with the boosts we have on the lot. Um, but yeah, oh my gosh, this is so cute. I love this. Oh my gosh, look at the macaroni. That's really cute. It's going on the wall of pictures. Um, just put it there. Perfect. Maybe I'll have her come. Um, oh, she's... Oh, she's chatting with Corbin. That's cute. That's really cute. Aw, they're having fun. Maybe they should play video... They should totally play video games. Um, play multiplayer game. Play Party Frenzy with Corbin. Yay! Oh, he can pass on, like, the love of video games. Down the generations. Oh, wait. No, you should... They're all sitting on the couch, so they should, um, all play together. There we go, because you wouldn't want to be left out, now would you? Um... <laughs> That glass of water is honestly bigger than her face. <laughs> I don't know why I'm so offended by that, but I, like, honestly am. You know what? We need to get paintings of the girls. I guess I'll wait till they're teenagers because, I mean, they kind of look like every other sim child in the world um, right now. But, oh, are you done exercising? No, you gotta, you gotta exercise till you drop. Let's, um... Let's heavy lifting push the limits. Um, although I should be careful with her, seeing as she's getting up there in age. Um, but yeah. <laughs> what are you listening to? What? What are you listening to right now? I have no idea. What is it? World music. Okay, you go for it. I, that's not what I would choose to exercise to, but... Oh, I also exercise the audiobook, so what do I know? I'm gonna, like, clean up this house, because they're, like, literal pigs. Also, somebody needs to start cooking. Like, honestly, um, <laughs> how much food do we have left over from Connie? Let's see. Um, we have spoiled food. Okay, so this is not food. And then we have one plate of food left over. Oh my god, that's awful. So after Selena's all done with that, I'm gonna have her, like, start cooking. Or maybe I'll have, um, Marcus do it or something, but... Oh my gosh, look at the little superhero! Oh, that's really cute. You know what bugs me, though? I mean, it's not that huge of a deal, but, like, none of those toys... Like, they, they have a couple, like, human or sim toys, you know? Like, human-looking toys, and they're, like, both white and blonde. That's kind of obnoxious. Um, but, yeah. Sorry if this episode is a little slow going. I think... Oh, wow, she's almost ready. Oh, yay, she reached fitness level 8. That is fantastic. Um, but I think I will kind of speed up a little bit. You know, um, just because it's kind of a lazy weekend day. Where's Corbin going? 
What are you? Oh my God, no. Corbin, don't do it. Don't do it. Corbin, no. Oh my God, oh my God. Stop him. Stop him. He's about to break. The, don't, don't break it. Don't break it. Okay. Okay. He's just harassing the teddy bear again. Oh my gosh. We have two hotheads in here. What are you going to do now? What are you doing? Oh my God. They're both like vying for this teddy bear's like attention, but I don't want Corbin breaking the super expensive like dollhouse. So I'm just going to ask him to leave right now because he's like way too angry to have in the house. Like the kids, they can't destroy the dollhouse. They're good. I wonder if she can do it. Oh, she can. Oh my God. Oh my God. Girl, get out of this room right now. Out of this room. Oh, it's because she was a sore loser. So did Mabel win? Oh, Mabel won. Mabel won. Oh God. Mabel won and she made the two members of her family who are hotheads extraordinarily angry. But you should like not just stand there. You should like actually like exit this room. I would appreciate that. Come on, girly. Is she stuck? Okay, there we go. Um, but yeah, so let's have um, Selena try and cook. I don't even know what her cooking level is, but we will cook something that does not require very much, but we'll just... Okay, everybody, you're going to be eating subpar garden salad from here on out. Enjoy! Um, but yeah, we're going to lock this door um, for like just every everyone but Mabel right now um, that'll probably annoy me later on but we will just <laughs> this girl this girl why don't you like like train a void critter or something there we go and we can have her start to like draw something or other shapes um but yeah I will quickly speed through this um see how we're going and because tomorrow it will be sa sunday sa sunday is a new day um it's between saturday and sunday and it is in my imaginary make-believe world um but <laughs> have the girls done their homework i am all over the place um mabel has done her homework Selene or er, salem has not which is kind of typical because Malum's such goody two shoes but um, I will quickly speed through all of this and get back to you. So I actually forgot that Selena had work. So that's what she's going to do now. So now it's just the girls home alone. Oh my God, I can hear the train again. That's so obnoxious. Um, but we'll just, we'll just speed through them, you know, doing whatever. Who was she training last time? I want to actually maybe try and do this. I don't know. I haven't ever, like, I haven't done all that much with the Void Critter stuff because it takes a while. But I will now go back to speeding up again. Oh, my gosh. I'm the worst. But that's okay. Okay. So, Marcus, or I mean, yes, Marcus. Are you Marcus? Yes, Marcus is home, and he is sick. He has terrible welts all over his body, and he is stuffed up. <laughs> so, we're going to have him go um grab some medicine um order medicine there we go why is it so expensive oh, i guess that's realistic um oh so he has now oh my god don't die bro <laughs> don't do it um but yeah now he can just take this medicine and he should be all fine and dandy here we go down the hatch magical potion and okay <laughs> those the pox the, the pox just left his body the pox marks are now gone i think i might just um oh god <coughs> excuse me i'm just gonna harvest all these um and then maybe water them um and then we need salem to actually do her homework because it's a thing it's a thing that needs to be done but yeah <laughs> we are just kind of coasting along right now like everybody's kind of just skilling up um yeah but let's see how much money um the garden is going to bring in i can like faintly hear the train again and i know you guys can't but it's like driving me crazy um but let's see, 80 dragon fruit, sell that. Oh my gosh, 4,600 simoleons, 10 grapes, um, just a measly, um, like almost 300, but like still, like, 
Does anyone else feel like the house is empty? I feel like the house is empty. Maybe that's just me, and maybe it's because the girls, because the Sim children are kind of uninteresting. Um, like, I'm trying to give them personalities, but honestly, it's like the Sim kids are, like, really boring in the Sims, but <laughs> we'll get them through. I think, um, I think I will age them. I don't know. I'll age them up maybe when they both have A's, but that being said, I don't know if maybe, um... Maybe Salem will get an A, but she's just not really that academic. Um, but, like, I mean, look at this one. She's just, like, already poorly practicing the violin. But <laughs> uh, I know what Marcus should do. He shouldn't be doing that. He should be painting. Um, let's do a... Uh, let's do, just do this large thing. Okay, I think I will fast forward a bit again. I'm sorry. I hope that's not too obnoxious to anybody. Um, I, I think I'm going to, next episode, I'm going to try and think of like an actual like outing we can do because right now it's just kind of like me um, doing intense maintenance work. But yeah. <laughs> oh, oh wow. Selena got a promotion. Sorry if that was sudden for anyone. It was sudden for me, but... Um, now we need to choose between a bodybuilder and a professional athlete. Oh, I also the train is going on right now. I'm just going to pause for a second. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, I think it's finally passed. That is like the world's most annoying train. It's literally been like going on and off in the background for like the last like 15 minutes. But anyways, so I, well, I was having time to think it over. I decided that I want Selena to be a bodybuilder because um, I don't know. I think that just kind of fits. It says, sculpt your body into the form of a god, and that's kind of what her aspiration is in life. So, yeah, but let's see if she got anything exciting. She got a rug, um, mentor fitness interaction, and suggest workout interaction. Interesting, and she got a little bit of money and, of course, a raise. So let's go check out this rug, this, like, fancy, dancy, fancy, dancy, fancy, dancy rug. And of course, everything is dark in here. Um, but yeah, perfect, perfect. Um, let's just like do it like this. And then, oh yeah, there's like a painting in here. We'll like move. We're just going to like reward Selena with like a personal like fitness gym. Just got in some mirrors maybe. Um, uh, apparently, we have now gone into decor mode. But we'll just put that there, and then let's grab um, a um, little boxing rig, and we'll do that in, like, a nice green color. Or actually, everything is blue in here. Is, is there? I bet I could go with the cheap. Nope, the cheaper one doesn't come in blue, so you get a green. Um, but yeah, so now um, she, I wonder, would she unlock this? Oh, this is a criminal career? Whoa interesting um but she'll unlock this like cool weight machine and then she'll unlock this in the astronaut career this is so weird um and yeah, i don't know why those punching bags are where they are but um it is getting a little bit late into the episode um and so i will now speed up until morning that way we can make a wish from the wishing well Oh, wow. Ooh, I like this outfit. Ooh, this is fancy. I've never seen this before. She's got, like, little weight, like, um, brace and stuff. She looks great. I'm loving this. I'm loving this. I've never done this career before, I don't think. Like, not all the way through. So, ooh. Okay, so Selena is bored from something about clubs, um, but I just realized that, like, she works, like, really early morning at 7 a.m., so it is good that she woke up so early so that we can, ooh, let's have her jog there, oh yeah, this little fitness junkie that she is, um, but that way, oh, like, nope, <laughs> she has nope on her shirt, and she's, like, so, like, tired, um, but yeah, like, she also just hasn't had, like, any time to, like, prepare for work the next day, so that's a little bit of a bummer. I don't know if you just heard that, but that's okay, I was, like, a huge crashing noise, um, but let's make an offering, a little, a little itty-bitty offering, um, just so, like, she's, uh, wishing well isn't so mad, 
oh, what, are you bored by this, Selena? This is only your life. You're only taking, like, your life into your hands. Oh, but he looks happy. Yay. That's, like, the first time in forever. Maybe we'll get something good. But it's Sunday, so let's wish for skills. I am really excited. Her hair looks beautiful, by the way, too. Oh, no. It's not good. Gosh darn it. We haven't had a really great one. Um, Selena thought a flick of a coin would be enough to gain a skill. No, she'll have to work for it. But her wish will provide a boost to any skill gains for a period of time. Okay, so that's not, it's not too, too bad. Um, look at those light bulbs going around her head. Um, but, um, <laughs> oh my goodness. I... I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, feel free to give me a like, a comment, or subscribe, especially if you'd like to be notified as to when the next episode is. Oh, yeah, the next episode should be Christmassy. Oh, I could, uh, yeah. Okay, anyways, but I hope you guys are all having a great day, and I will see you guys next time. Bye! They won't feed me, Connie. Help! Connie's like, I'm on it, babe. I'm on it. I'll make us the best birthday cake ever. We don't need these, please.